Rush. This is also available in HPC. One pack of bleaching powder, 30 grams, also from my trusted brand, HPC. Okay, you also need to have a developer or oxidizing lotion. And if you're opting to have blonde hair, it should be 12%. Now to protect your hair from damage, you need to buy a bottle of virgin coconut oil. And it's better to apply it overnight before the bleaching process. And for taking care of your hair, you should also need to buy a hair treatment. And mine is from Watson's, from Glamworks. Lastly, you need a plastic bowl to mix the ingredients. Let's begin. I forgot to say you need to have protection for your hands, so I'm wearing some gloves here. So, for HPC, the sales lady taught me that it should be 8 cups of developer for one packet of bleaching powder. You need to measure it thoroughly. Time to put the powder. Well, as you can see, I changed the container. Uh, this is an old bottle of the treatment that I had before. It's because it, the mixture will bubble up, so it will overflow if I use the other measure, um, other cup. So I replaced it. Be careful to touch this with your hands. Uh, this tends to hurt uh, your fingers so you really need to have gloves like what I'm wearing it also has a very powerful smell so if you have your kids just tell them to stay in another room and also wear a mask you're not gonna inhale this concoction so you can see it will turn Slightly purplish in color while you're mixing it. I'm just transferring the other. Hi, quirkies! Good evening, gabi na. Pero kasi kaninang mga gabi na rin ako nakabili ng bleach. So, kung napanood yun yung video ng una kong pag-dye, uh, pag-bleach ng sarili and pag-dye, um, ililink ko na lang yung video sa baba. So, today, um, magbe-bleach ako ulit kasi yung gusto ko nga ma-achieve na hair, which is yung peachy pink, hindi ko na-achieve kasi nga, first time, um, nung first time ko mag-bleach, isang beses lang. Tsaka yung ginamit ko, ibang bleach, yun kasama sa kit na binili ko dun sa, um, sa Wenny Color. So, yun. So, gumamit ako ng ibang bleach, which is yung Ortalesa. Sorry, nakaglabas ako ngayon. 12% kasi yung sinabi din sa akin dun sa store, kung blunt or lightest blunt talaga yung gagamitin, kailangan na 
ng 12%. Tapos kung nakikita nyo, Cortez, naka-gloves ako, pinakita ko na kanina sa inyo yung paghahalo. So, ngayon, mag apply tayo. Um, kung napapansin nyo yung hair ko, sa taas talaga yung parang medyo blonde-ish. Tapos, dito sa baba naman, yung ginawa ko, nilagyan ko ng pink pair, parang naging ano siya, magenta or parang naging reddish. So, mag na tayo. Um, gagawin ko lang naman is per section section. Tapos, bago ko pala makalimutan, natutunan ko to, bago kayo mag-bleach ng hair para ma-protect yung hair nyo, kailangan nyo ng virgin, virgin coconut oil or VCO. Um, kano lang, mga 180 plus sa Watsons. So, naganto na ako kanina. Um, pwede nga overnight eh. Kung baga, gabi before kayong mag- mag-bleach. So, yun. Umpisa na natin. Please, ayan na siya. Hindi siya pantay. <laughs> And I'm not gonna lie. It's so dry. 
Kaya para maalagaan yung buhok natin, kailangan natin itong treatment and yung coconut oil. So, puti treatment lang ako. Um, bababad ko sa buhok ko. Tapos, ayan, ako malambot na. Bababad ko siya sa buhok ko ng 1 um, hour. Tapos, after nun, bago ko matulog, kapag medyo nag-dry-dry dry na yung buhok, mag-a-apply na ako ng coconut oil. For case update sa hair, ito na siya. Mas malight yung nasa taas kasi nga yung nag-bleach kami dito ng mga ka-church mate ko, mga ka group ko. Ito lang yung roots lang yung yung na-bleach. So, binleach ko yung baba. Medyo nag-light yung kasi nga yung dating pink na ginawa ko. Nag-light. So, para siyang peach. <laughs> Siyempre, gusto ko talaga pumantay silang lahat. Pero yung yung color talaga niya is pinky peach talaga, hindi talaga blonde. So, ano pa lang to, work in progress pa lang, pero sana dun sa video na sundan nyo how to bleach your hair. So, yun lang. Ang advice ko lang talaga kung kayo mag-bleach bleach sa bahay, uh, yung katulad ng ginawa ko is may gloves tapos may mask. Tsaka, ano, maganda na, maganda talaga yung bleach tsaka yung developer ng ng L, uh, ng HBC kasi mas ano siya yung naglight kagat 12% mas, kung gusto nyo talaga kumapit yung color or katulad nga nung plano ko which is pastel hair pinky peach yung gusto ko so yun mas madali yung ganun kesa yung kunwari 6% lang yung developer or yung ganun yung mababang developer lang ang mangyaya <laughs> mangyayari. Maraming beses kayo magbe-bleach, diba? So, ganun. Pagpapahingayin ko ulit yung hair ko for one week. Tapos, magbe-bleach ulit ako ng last na last na. Tapos, bago ko ilagay yung color. So, mamimiss ko dito yung blonde na hair na to. Pero, <laughs> ayaw na asaw. Medyo ayaw na asaw. Pero, okay lang naman sa akin. Pero, nung una talaga nagulat ako. Kasi, parang, anong nangyari? Parang, light na light dito sa taas. Tapos, yung reddish na baba naging parang light yung ganyan. Para akong ano, para akong araw na may fire sa dun. <laughs> eh, hindi mo talaga yung gusto. Tuloy para akong ano, um, nagbabanda or something. <laughs> or kung okay lang naman sa so, parang feeling ko nagko-host na yan. Kaya okay lang. So, sana nagsana yung video. Follow me on my journey to my um, dream hair which is pastel colored hair. Yung una, naging iba, naging dark yung taas, tas naging reddish naman yung baba. Um, pero maganda rin naman. Maraming nagsabing maganda. Pero gusto ko talaga light. So, yun. After ng bleach, sana maging maganda. Sige, Cortez! God bless! My advice is you need to give your hair a rest before bleaching. So, after I bleached my hair for the first time, it's really dry. It was really dry, so I rested where I put my hair to rest for a month. Then after that, my second and my last or my third bleach, bleaching process, we, it has um, two weeks interval. And for taking care of the hair, you really need to have a non-sulfate shampoo. I use L'Oreal Pure Care mixed with a food color purple food color as my toner or my diy toner it really works great to eliminate the rusty or the orange color from your hair and you really need to use the shampoo once or twice a week only it really works wonders and for the hair treatment i really recommend that glam works treatment for color treated hair you can use it every day. And as you can see, I really went from my dark hair until to the lightest pale blonde. I really like this blonde color, but my aim is really to have peachy colors. So stay tuned for my next tutorial. Thank you. Bye, Kirkies.